Hey everybody, this is Modern Refugee. Um, the basis of uh, preparedness is good information, is good intel. And uh, if you have good intel, you can make good decisions and then you can sometimes prevent problems. Um, you can see things ahead of time so you can uh, be proactive in a lot of things. And uh, you can make uh, you can make a good uh, good decisions if you have good intel. Now there's something that I have seen many, many times over the last few years pop up on social media and videos, news articles and stuff. And uh, I found out the answer to this a long time ago and uh, because I know some people in the know, so to speak. And uh, that is, why do big box stores always throw out all this fresh food after a um, power outage? And everybody's seen the videos on it, the pictures on it, you know, dumpsters full of food, shopping carts full of food, black plastic hanging over the coolers and the bunkers, this kind of stuff. And uh, there's always just a lot of wild speculation of what's going on, what are they doing with that food, why are they throwing it out. And uh, I was uh, told this a long time ago by people in the know what is going on in that particular situation. And I don't agree with it at all. I don't think that food should be thrown out or wasted for whatever reason. And uh, it's basically waste, but there is a reason why they're doing that. And uh, basically what it is, is when that food temps to a certain level, and it's over a certain level, that has to be discarded. Then, and here's what the uh, important part is, then if there's a certain amount of food that is discarded, those big box stores have insurance policies on that food if that happens. So you have a whole bunch of food, it temps above, it has to be discarded, it's over a certain dollar amount, it automatically triggers that insurance policy, the store gets their money back from the insurance policy, the insurance now owns that food, and that food has to be destroyed per that insurance policy. And that's why you see big dumpsters full of food and big uh, shopping carts full of food sitting after power outages in these big box stores. Because those big businesses always outsource everything and they take uh, precautions against things like that through insurance policies. So the insurance pays the store. The store doesn't care anymore. It honors the uh, whatever you want to call it, the uh, the terms of that policy and that food has to be destroyed. The food no longer even belongs to the store at that point, belongs to the insurance company. Sort of like in some states, when a car is totaled on the road, it uh, it's totaled by the insurance company. It can no longer be put on the road. It can be sold for parts or whatever, or you know, just scrapped out because it can no longer be put on the road. It can be no longer be used because that's the insurance company's call. So that's big business for you. That's how they run things. They don't care that that food can maybe possibly still be used or whatever. And you know, there's certain, I guess, litigation. You know, they could be sued if somebody ate bad food or something like that. But that's not. Not the major portion of it. The major portion of it is, is that insurance policy where they get their money back after the fact because of a power outage because it was over a certain amount. And like I said, I've never seen that. I've listened to just countless videos and read different blogs and different uh, news articles on it. And I've never ever heard what I heard as far as why that takes place. So that's why I wanted to do this video and let people know that's why they are doing that. So you guys got good information and uh, good information nowadays is sometimes hard to come by. Anyway, this is Modern Refugee. I appreciate all my subscribers out there. Hope you guys got a little information, a little entertainment out of this video and uh, something to think about the next time you read or see one of those articles on uh, all that food being thrown out, what the true reason is behind it, just big business and money. Anyway, you guys take care.